So here's just a real quick walkthrough as for how this gate sequencer uh, input thing works. Um, and this is basically the old sequencer. It has 12 sequences which can have various lengths and uh, various speeds. And um, yeah, you've got your note layers and octave and stuff. I'll enhance that. Uh, that can have different lengths, so decoupled from uh, the step count of your main main sequence. Um, and this is like the little breakout box I built. Uh, it's connected with a with a um, Eurorack cable to the Raspberry Pi, which runs the PD patch, which controls the sequencer like the brain. And now I'll just be feeding that little breakout box a. Um, gate here from the clock divider so you see what it's doing I've, I've got it set up to blink here if it receives the gate or display the gate so I plug it in and hit the first input now you see my first pin uh, my first uh, button blinks I can it's lower there and then there are other inputs Give me a sec there. Uh, second one for example then you can start um, yeah, mapping this stuff out to functions in your application as I said it's currently only gate or clock signals pulses um it's it doesn't convert the analog voltages to digital signals uh to digital values yes